Softing. In this video, we are going to explain how to perform a set reference using the dual ended one jumper method with Wire Expert. You will require a pair of Wire Expert units configured as local and remote, a pair of encircled flux compliant multimode fiber test adapters, a pair of Simplex FC to SC launch cords, a pair of Simplex SC to SC tail cords, and a duplex mating coupler provided in the test kit. Insert the test adapters to both local and remote units of Wire Expert. On the setup screen, select Test Settings. Select Standard Limits. Select Limit Standard from the list depending on requirement. Enter the number of connections and splices within the link under Test. The loss per number of connector and loss per splice values are the recommended values according to the test standard selected. Leave the values unchanged unless necessary. Press the OK button to save any changes made. Select Configuration on the setup screen. Select Dual Ended One Jumper Referencing Method. A dual ended test is used to measure the loss of the fiber and connectors on both ends and connections within the link under test. Select Single or Bi Direction to perform a single to double directional measurement test. Single direction performs loss test only on one end of the link under test, in the initial direction from the transmit to the receive end. Bi direction performs loss test on both end of the link under test, in the initial direction from the transmit to the receive end, and reverse direction by swapping positions of the launch and tail cords. Fiber loss measurement should be done in bi direction as provides a more accurate result. Selecting single or bi direction test will not affect the set reference procedure. Press the OK button to save selections. Ensure that the end faces of the fiber cords and test adapters are clean and not damaged before proceeding. Connect the FC end of the launch cord to the TX port of the local unit, and the SC end to the RX port of the remote unit. Connect the FC end of the other launch cord to the TX port of the remote unit, and the SC end to the RX port of the local unit. Press the Tools button. Select Set Reference. Press the Next button to continue. Once Set Reference is complete, check that the Set Reference result is between minus 18 dBm to minus 20 dBm. As mentioned in the earlier video, as reference is only done for the launch cord, verification test is required for the tail cords. Disconnect only the SC end of the launch cord from the RX port of both local and remote units. Do not disconnect the FC end of the launch cords at any point. Connect the disconnected SC end of the launch cords to either side of the mating coupler. Connect one SC end of the tail cords to the RX ports of both local and remote units. Connect the other SC end of the tail cords to the mating coupler. Press the Auto Test button. Check that the result passes with a result not higher than 0.15 decibels. Dual ended one jump reference method is now completed. Have a look at the other videos or visit our website to explore the other various features of Wire Expert. Thanks for watching.